Peace and blessings. How y'all doing? Um, T Brown TV back again with another video. I know, I know. What I said about like t maybe two, three videos ago that I was talking about the Fetty Wap situation. Well, it is now, man. So I'm gonna make this video. You gonna be quick, little simple, whatever. All right. So we know that Fetty Wap got caught by the feds, by the FBI, at the Rolling Loud at City Fields in New York. You know, what I'm saying Queens where the um the Mets play. So basically, they did Rolling Loud tour at the um. At the um, Met Stadium, just like maybe last week or so. So they say they on whistle. They say that when the feds come get you, what I'm saying like anytime we get caught by the FBI, it's a wrap. Was it was it 95 or 98 percent conviction rated? So which means that it's hard. It's gonna be hard for it's gonna be hard for you just to beat these charges, especially with the feds. The states, what's the states? You will. I'm saying you will get away with it, but. Most of the time, like I say, anytime if it's a feds, it's gonna be hard for you just to beat that um that case. So allegedly, that Fetty Wap was caught drug trafficking, um, narcotic distri distribute, um, he had um fentanyl, all types of drugs, crack, cocaine, and um firearm. Then he had maybe five hundred thousand dollars worth of cash or something like that. But anyways, Fetty Wap, let me say something. Fetty Wap used to be hot back in the day. Well, not back in the day, maybe like what? Maybe three, four, five years ago, you was on top. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you was hot. You was one of the hottest art artists coming out um Patterson, New Jersey. So here we go again in 2021. You're not hot no more. You're not, I'm saying you're not irreverent no more. To be honest, because like I said, your money's drying up. So which means that anytime you're not making a hit record or you're not making music like that which means that your money's drying up so which means that you have to go back you know well i'm saying not go back but like you say you have you know what i'm saying you have your second your second option just to sell drugs just sell coke heroin fentanyl all that stuff man i mean like i said it's, it's sad that you know he had to um he had to go through this route he shouldn't i'm saying like he shouldn't have to go through this route man but i'm guessing that you know what I'm saying? Like, when the money's drying up, you know what I'm saying? We run out money like that. I'm saying, like, you know, like, you don't got it like that no more. You got, like I said, you got to come up with another hustle. You know, you got to sell drugs. So, which means that we know he was out on he was out on bail. So, um, next thing you know, you ain't done yet. Because, like I said, now something like you got, you got to go to federal court for this case. So, which means that you, you could look at some... I'm not saying life in prison, but I could say what? What, 25 years of life? Some 30 years, 30 years, 25, 30 years at the most? It's really sad though, man. And like I said, I, I keep telling these rappers, man, like, y'all rappers out there, if you like say, if you're not making music like if you're not making music like that no more, if you're not putting out no hit records, and I'm saying like your money's drying up. Please do not go to this route that he went through, man. Selling drugs, fitting on heroin. Don't go through that route because I'm pretty sure that I be telling, I be telling, I be saying this, man. For instance, look at Jay Z. He don't have to rap like that no more. Like I say, he don't rap like that no more. You know what I'm saying? He don't have to rap because he's a corporate rapper. He's 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 on he's on a whole different level because like I say, one thing about Jay Z. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like when he first got got into the game, he was rapping, rapping, rapping. Also at the same time, he was investing, investing. Team, team, teaming up with, you know what I'm saying, with, with companies and this and that. So, like I said, Jay-Z just took us to another level because, like I said, you can't rap forever. So, which means that, I'm going to say this though. If you're rapping right now, make sure you invest, save, invest to other companies because, like I said, once you get done retiring with rap or whatever, with, with that being the case, you got some other, um, you got some other hustle. You got some other money coming in. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you could team up with, um, it could be Nikes, Adidas, whoever, you know, spawn, like I said, endorsement deals, sponsors, sponsorship, but Fetty Wap, he didn't, he, like I said, to be honest with you, he didn't level up, man. So, I mean, like I said, I'm pretty sure he didn't invest. He didn't invest his money right. So basically he didn't follow procedures. So like I said, he just had to go through the, um, the, I'm saying the illegal way. Let me say something. Legal money is begging it is better than illegal money because, like I said, once you make legal money, you don't have to worry about the 
the law enforcement, the FBI, whoever, the authorities to look over your shoulders. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. That's when you that's when you sell illegal money. You have to look over your shoulders. But when you're selling legal money, you don't have to look, you know what I'm saying? Like you don't have to look over your shoulders. You could just, you know, be comfortable, you know, have that, you know, bread. Just keep piling up and piling up. But you know, it is what it is. So like I said, man, you know, Fetty Wap, man, I'ma say this, man. You need to clean up your act. You need to get yourself together, man, because it ain't over yet. Cause you got, like I said, you gotta go to court for this, though. Let you know. So it is what it is. Alleging, allegedly, that you know he got caught. So that's it, though, man. So that's all I gotta say, though. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. Like, share, share this message. I mean, I share this message. Share this video if you feel like it. If you don't, it's all good, though. Like I said, it don't cost anything but free, though. So, like I said. Hit that mother freaking bell. Subscribe my page. And also, like I said, you can add me on Instagram. I'm going to say this again. It's Mr. Underscore Handsome Underscore 704. I'm going to say this again. Add me on Instagram. It's Mr. With an MR Underscore Handsome Underscore 704. It is what it is. Like I said, peace. I'm out of here. But anyway, I don't know. But like I said, I'm out. I'm going I'm to come back with another video because, like I said, I got some more topics I need to bring. So, bring some dope content. So, it is what it is. I'm out.